out to all my fellow Leo gang gang in the building. I am C, the spiritual goddess here for your message for the month of July. This is your urgent message that Spirit wants you to hear now. This is for all my fellow Leos. If you don't know, July 25th coming through. <laughs> Leave me a Leo emoji in the comments below to let me know you are a Leo stopping through. So today I did pull three cards from the Psychic Tarot deck. So we're going to see what message does Spirit have for you. Don't forget, if you do want to book a reading with me, all that information will be left below. I do have openings available, so make sure you book me today. All right, so let's go ahead and flip over the three cards we have. Okay, so we have some interesting cards here. We have the Love Begins, the Moving On, and the Balance card. All right, Leo. So off rip, Spirit is saying for a lot of you, I feel like you may have been coming out of a period um, where basically you, 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 you went through war is what spirit is telling me. Um, you may have your, it's like, you may have had a, a dark period or maybe it wasn't even a dark period. Maybe you just had a very stressful period. Um, that last moon, I know the last, uh, moon, um, I forget which moon it was, but it was about releasing. I know I did like a spiritual re spiritual bath, spiritual release. I feel like for a lot of us, this is coming into play. Even if you didn't do a spiritual release, maybe it was just a situation you got fed up with. Spirit is saying, now the party can begin. We have the Love Begins card. Okay, so I feel like everything that you've been going through, went through and within moving on with that situation, the party can really begin, okay? <laughs> Basically, uh, Spirit is letting you know you can find true balance. You're at a point, I feel like, not before my Leos. Um, you've been, probably just with the beginning of this year, especially with everything that's been going on with 2020, it's kind of, you know, took us off of balance, you know? But sometimes you have to be fall off of balance to get back to get back on track you know it seemed like the tides are turning in the world and with that being said it's also turning personally for us i see for a lot of us there will be a windfall of cash coming down i feel like there's going to be an unexpected for some of you expect it like you've been expecting this this to come down here you're going to find that there also uh, for a lot of you you're going to finally be at peace about a situation you're going to make your peace with that situation i know it's light but if you look at that angel kind of like it's glowing a little bit i feel like that's going to be your presence for like the rest of the year like you're going to have like an unbothered kind of presence so for some of you um if this is a relationship I do feel like, um, if the, um, for some of you, I might feel like this, this may, there may be a new relationship or a new, um, you know, partnership that's going to grow, grow more. And you guys are finally going to find balance in your relationship. Um, you know, I'm with another Leo, July 25th. <laughs> but, uh, you know, the biggest thing I always say when people ask me about um, being in a relationship with a Leo is, the biggest the biggest thing we have a problem with is finding balance but once we find balance oh we are the best compromisers skip what everyone is saying okay that's the common misconception about leos that we don't like to compromise when when in reality once we find balance once we know when to use our power and when to draw back that's when you can truly flourish in a that's when you can truly flourish in a relationship yes the fool ready Okay, I'm about to finish up this reading now. So yeah, gods and goddesses, this, I am so excited for this message. So what Spirit wants you to do, Spirit wants you to um, to go ahead. I would definitely suggest for some of you, if you have been feeling out of balance, definitely suggest some root chakra to get you back in balance. Also, um, some heart chakra, because you do want to be open to receiving love also. All right, so let me know what you guys think about this reading below in the comments. Um, did this reading give you any clarity? Don't forget to also follow me on IG. You know it goes down on my Instagram there. Until then, gods and goddesses, don't forget to always rock your crown. See you in the next video. Peace.